Hey everybody, so another forever baby, forever for the moment, is leaving my house. This is Ryan, but he's going home as a girl. I did a trade with, um, she used to make a lot of videos when I first started reborning, or got into the community, so hopefully she starts making more videos. Uh, she was one of the channels that I enjoyed watching, and then... Life happens and things happen and she just hasn't really made much videos anymore. So hopefully with um, all the new babies she's going to be getting here soon, she'll start making some videos. So I did a trade with her. Um, I don't really ever do trades on Reborn dolls too often. But she has a Julie Malloy silicone doll. Um... That I really want. Well, I really wanted a Julie Molloy silicone doll. Not because they're like fabulously painted. But because they feel so amazing. Their silicone is unexplainable. It is like this crazy feeling. It's like a memory foam mattress. I don't know. It's crazy. But then they look just like a baby when it's just born all red and whatever. So I did a trade with her. Um, she's getting Ryan. And then I'm making her. I'm painting and rooting her uh, a kit of her own. I'm not gonna tell what they are because I don't know if she wants to keep them a secret right now. And then I had a kit here and I'm making that as a custom for her too. So in the next couple months, she'll be getting two more babies. So um, that equaled the value of the doll. So I'm really excited. But I have her here. I'm gonna package her up. I've got her COA here. I have my COA here to go with her. Um, I have her belly plate, which I'm just gonna stick it right here on top. That's just the best way for me to send them out. She does have a couple outfits I'm gonna send her with. Ah, you're stepping all over everything. So I got a couple outfits I'm sending her with, and which are right here. They're new. They actually just came with my silicone that I got today. But I thought they would look really good with her skin tone. So, you know, works out well. I can send them with her. And then she does take a magnetic pacifier. So there we go. She has a pacifier as well. So I just thought I would get her boxed up. Share with you guys. I know, okay. I know that a lot of people are going to miss Ryan. But you guys know how my channel works. It's kind of like a foster care <laughs> thing when it comes to the Reborns. I do have a lot of new babies coming into my collection. Whether they're, well, the silicone that I just did the trade for. And then I have, um, oh my gosh, I just got a kit on eBay last night that I had in my collection years ago. And I sold him when... I got my first prototype. So I have the Walter by Laura Tuzio Ross coming back to me to paint and I cannot wait to paint it because now my skills are so much better than when I painted it back then even though he did look really cute. So I have Walter coming for my collection. Um, I like that kit even more than I like the Quinlan kit. I just do better with open eye babies. And that kit, I've always really, really enjoyed. Um, Quinlan was like a learn to enjoy over time. And it was more like a, oh, I couldn't get my hands on the kit, so I wanted it. But anyways, so Walter is coming. I have a doll that I just finished painting that will get hair soon. That's going to be part of my collection. A kit that I wanted arrived for Jackie to paint for me because I wanted her to make it for me because I knew she would do a really nice job with the baby. Well, not that I wouldn't do a nice job with the baby, but it's peachy vinyl and I love Jackie's work on a peachy vinyl and so she's going to make that for me. So I, you guys know I always have babies coming and going just because they come and go, you know, quite frequently doesn't mean I won't, I'm like leaving or anything. So I've always got babies coming and going. So yes, 
So those ones are on the way. And then, um, you know, there will be plenty more in the future. But also Drew is for sale. Drew's on eBay. If you look in the description below, you will find the link, excuse that sound, to Drew's eBay auction. Uh, the plan is that Jackie will be making me another Drew. Um, we'll just blame her for ruining the bond with that Drew because she made one and it's so amazing. She did sell it. Although she did tell me I could keep it, but I feel bad. I, sometimes I feel like I'm always taking the dolls that she makes. So I just told her, no, I don't want to do that. Just please sell it. And then um, I will actually have you make me my own. So that's what she's doing. So, yeah. I know you guys are bummed that Drew's leaving, but it's, it's only temporary. Uh, I'm excited for... Her to make me another Drew. So yeah, so if you guys want to buy the other Drew, which is super adorable Drew, just head over to the eBay auction. Um, you can feel free to make me a reasonable offer. I will tell you $475 is not a reasonable offer. Somebody did make me that offer today on eBay, so that's why I'm saying that because I completely declined it. I didn't even counter offer. I was like, really? No. So, um, and if it is sold outside of eBay, the price will be a bit cheaper. So you can contact me privately for that. It won't be $475, but it is a little bit cheaper because, man, eBay fees are crazy. So if I sell outside of eBay, eBay, I save on eBay fees. And then not only do you have eBay fees, but then you have PayPal fees on top of that. So it's like, oh, it's a lot. So anywho... So Ryan's ready to go home to his new mommy, who's super, her new mommy, who's super excited for her. And um, I'm sorry, guys, and I hope you guys enjoy the box packing. And as always, thank you so much for watching.